Hi Sagittarius, welcome to my channel. This reading for today, Sagittarius, this is a collective tarot reading session for you, Sagittarius. I hope you are doing well. I hope your finances are doing good, Sagittarius. This reading for today, this is for you. Let us see what is coming towards you, Sagittarius. What is the guided message that is meant for you to know? And ready for you to know, this is for the Sagittarius sign. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. Thank you guys for being here. If you would like to further connect with me, please click the bell. Please click subscribe and let us see what's coming towards you. What is your guided message and love, career, money, and general inspiration ships and guitars? What can I get for you, okay? This is for your sign. Let's look at your focus. Let's look at your situation. And let us see what is your message. What can I get for the Sagittarius sign? Please don't forget to click the bell, okay? Guest viewers, if you haven't clicked the bell, click the bell now and click subscribe. Oh, the moon card. You have the nine of cups, okay. You have the ace of swords. What's coming towards Sagittarius, please? Okay, let's start your reading. So... You're starting the reading with the seven of pentacles in here. You have the four of pentacles. You've got the three of pentacles in here. Um, I feel like there was a past energy or past situation that um, I think this is more of you, Sagittarius. I feel like it's um, I feel like it's a very You know what if you read thoroughly like if you read if you look at their action okay if you look at their action and your action because i feel like it's a collaboration here because seven of pentacles always speaks about you investing they're investing but then this is a whole back to um i'm kind of picking up a vibe because i don't normally focus into the past okay i'm all you know, I am a reader who the whatever took place in the past, it's in the past. We can't we can't change that. Uh, pre, I'm more of a predictive. I'll tell you what's gonna happen, and if it's not some good stuff, we can counter that with some good frequency. Well, with this one, I'm 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 downloading a lot of information about the past situation, and in a nutshell, it's telling you that with the four of pentacles, you might have. Um, you have you you're kind of wrong you know i'm picking up the vibe that you are not entirely correct with your decision to release this person on your life like you're you're understand you misunderstood it something like that cuz seven of pentacles you were invested they were invested and then there was a hold back and I'm really picking up the word that you misunderstood their action. And it could also be that this person might have understood, misunderstood you. So there was a misunderstanding. And after the misunderstanding, you guys couldn't hit the ground running. Like it wouldn't go back to its normal state of reality. Like the state, the state of your relationship, business, connection, it just wouldn't go back to that you know to how you want it to be the seven of pentacles the four of pentacles um the universe is kind of telling you let go of the past because there's so much of you and it's bigger than your misunderstanding i'm really picking up strongly that hey sagittarius there is this person there is this person sorry there is this person there is the situation the love could be love you know because i'm really really picking up the word that the feelings, the interest, the love, the friendship, the relationship, whatever you build together, it's stronger than the misunderstanding, okay? Yes, I mean, look at that. Come on, Sagittarius, look at that. Look at the temperance card. It looks like the angel is being sent towards you to advise you that, hey, Sagittarius, whatever took place in the past, it was a misunderstanding. The love they have for you, the respect they have for you, you know, 
the good vibe and the good frequency you share together, it's more than the misunderstanding. The love they have for you is bigger than the misunderstanding. Okay? Um, okay, let's, let's pick up more. Yeah, Three of Pentacles, because I was supposed to move to the Three of Pentacles. Lately, I've been picking up the same card. So it is, you know, I feel like this is spot on. So someone is going to make an effort, okay? There is a person who, you know what? This could be connected to money. There could be a misunderstanding connected to money, connected to effort. Oh, this is your effort. This is my effort. Misunderstanding. I don't want to make an effort. I don't want to make an effort too. So this could be a situation connected to money, um, finances. It could be effort. It could also be accountability in here. But the thing is, you have misunderstood each other. Like this person is actually not against you. But it so happened that you guys misunderstood and you guys, after the misunderstanding, you guys couldn't hit the ground running, okay? Now, that situation, three of pentacles in here, they're going to make a comeback, okay? Like, this is a person, Sagittarius, where they're very, you know, they're very, um, they're very outspoken. This person is very outspoken. And you too. So, maybe there was a clash of personality, but between now... I mean, soon, it could be around the time of the new moon that this person is going to make an effort and they want, they would like to negotiate. I mean, whoever this person is, Sagittarius, like, they don't want to wait. They want to neg neg negotiate. Like, they don't wait, negotiate. Okay? There's a person, you misunderstood them, they misunderstood you. They can't wait. They don't want to wait. They want to negotiate. As soon as they talk to you, as soon as they come forward... How can I make it up with you? How do we fix this? You know, let's not misunderstood. Let's negotiate, okay? So it could be proposal, business. It could also be love because there's a two of cups in here. It's a relationship too. They don't want to let you go. Another four. Look at that. Three, three. This is four and four. So they're not prepared to let you go. You know, like it could be like a big miss. It could be a big mug, big big oh my gosh it could be a big misunderstanding between the two of you but they want to remove the misunderstanding and they can't wait they don't want to wait they want to negotiate okay so that was that like their their feelings their love for you is bigger than the misunderstanding basically now you have the king of swords you have the queen of pentacles in it this is a male and a female and you've got the Cancer card or the Moon card in here. Let's see. The Cancer card, the Cancer card again. So, someone, there's someone who would like, because this is you. You've got, you've got something. This is you. You, you possess a pentacle, okay? You've, you've got something that someone needs, okay? Um, this is you. You're holding the pentacles in here. And this King of Swords wants you and the Pentacles, okay? There's someone who would move very quickly. I feel like it's gonna have, this is, I feel like this is gonna be activated between December, the, between December 11 up until the end of December. Um, they will start, this King of Swords, they would like to fast forward things and they would like to get you on board. So they would like you to start a job or they would like to get you on board, get you, uh, they want you to, they want to, they want to start working with you. They want to start talking to, they want, they want things to, five of wands. This person will be prioritizing you, five of wands. Someone wants you in a lover, a friendship or a business capacity because you've got something, this is you. And you've got the pentacles in here. And this person, okay, the king of swords. This person wants you and your pentacle. So they want you as their lover and your stability. So this person doesn't just like you or love you or wants you because of you, but because of what other factors or, you know, what other added thing that you could put in the table. So they want you. You know, they want you, I would say badly. They're confused if 
what's the moon card oh yes they want you very very badly i feel like this king of swords they're quiet so this person wants you desperately they want they really want you whoever this person is they want you to work they want you to start working they want to be in a relationship with you they want you as a friend they don't want to let you go they want everything about you they're confused on how they're going to tell you their feelings towards you their plan of you and them in the future you and them collaborating maybe in business maybe in professional but they want you someone wants you but they cannot say it okay someone wants you but they don't know how to chat about how they want you whoever this person is Sagittarius they don't have a very good interpersonal skills or it could be they're very intimidated of you but I can feel right now someone wants you very attracted to you they're confused on how they're going to say it the moon card like I don't know how to say to Sagittarius that I like working with Sagittarius or being your lover your friend but there's something that they want to say they want you and they don't want to they want you this could be professional capacity business maybe friendship maybe romantic but they want you and they're struggling to say they're very sad five of cups like this person like i'm so sad i, I don't know how to say it i don't know how I, I like they're very problematic on how they're going to present their proposal their feelings whatever their message whatever they want to say they're struggling to say it. it's also it it's also because you could be traveling you could be so busy you could also very dismissive of them okay you could also feel it's possible that you're so dismissive of, of them as well like you snub them <laughs> maybe you have a lot of option five of wands because i feel like this person is struggling to get your attention because you're the empress card you're not just beautiful and attracted you're not just beautiful and attractive Sagittarius you also have the Queen of Pentacles which means that you've got some power some influence you've got some money you've got some asset you've got some value you've got something in life that people will compete to hire you to be your friend to be your lover so you're very a VIP in their eyes you are a VIP this person it could be a lover it could be a friend could be someone at work but you know with the five of cups they're quite i'm sad i don't know how to say it like they're quite disappointed with how they're going to say it because but the thing is they have the ace of swords so this person is working on how they will say it like this person is studying you this is their nine of cups they might start asking you they want to go for a coffee they want to go for brunch they want to go for dinner um whoever this person is they will start to mingle to connect with you to show you good vibe to show you good spirit to show you good interest and it's more of the way they will tell you their agenda their feelings their motive their plan for you and them they're gonna do it in a slow steady motion and not only that but they want to feel comfortable with you until then once they're comfortable comfortable with you because looking at the ace of swords and the five of cups like this person i would like to solidify my confidence with sagittarius and to do that i need to be confident and comfortable with sagittarius and how do i do that i need to spend lots of time with sagittarius either talking emailing working together but they want to spend lots of time getting to know you working with you maybe talking to you maybe flirting with you so they are comfortable and once they're comfortable they will solidly deliver yeah this person will hand over to you their feelings you know it is a person who is i would say they won't disappoint you to be honest with you Sagittarius, whoever this person is you might find them slow but they're far more better than what you think and what you can get yes because the five of cups in here this is them imagine this person is so sad if they're going to lose you as their friend lover ally or a business business partnership this is how serious they are to you they're, if it's gonna make them sad if they lose you i'm really really picking up the word that this person slowly will build up some momentum to you some time some catch up and they're also very patient they're very patient Sagittarius because if you're not available it's fine if you're not available 
if you're not available if you're not free it's fine i will be patient with you because i really want you and me to have a deep connection to have a deep conversation and also this person is very uh when it comes like productive conversation they want the conversation to not just get to know you but for you to like them okay so they 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 know i'm using the word they know how to make things a productive conversation it means that once they talk to you or you talk to them they don't want to just get to know you they don't want to just express how they like you or working with you or whatever agenda they want from you it's not just saying what they want from you also they want you to like them back so this is not just all about them it's also about you liking them back so this person is really someone that is prepared and is going to make you interested of them sagittarius look at this card there you go and boom you've got the soulmate so it could be a lover um lately when i pick up the lover i find that the lover's energy it has become romantic or soulmate or they've got a soulmate intention so if you notice if i will be using the word they have a soulmate intention i tell you it's sincere so they have a soulmate intention romantically professionally personally it could be friend relative but they have a soulmate intention towards you and they want to solidify their courage to speak up their feelings their agenda towards you whatever they want to give you whatever they want to tell you they want to solidify that by slow and steady catch up and also ace of swords they want you sagittarius to like them they want you to receive they want you to organically like them so they're here to impress and not only that to get you into their team to get you into their life and i tell you i'm really hearing the word they are far more better than you think they're far more the value that you can get from them is far more that you can ever get you know like big time like discreetly this person is big time i would be pleasantly surprised sagittarius of when you found out you know once you once you found out their offer and how much they can bring to you in your life amazing sagittarius so please be patient this person is warming up they will get there they will deliver the news the question their feelings and they will get you this person is willing to work hard solidly to get you to like them so prepare sagittarius this is gonna happen in real time okay this is your reading thank you so much sagittarius for connecting with me thank you so much for being here the private reading is now open check out the website i have um, a limited uh, spot to accommodate in terms of um the private reading it's everything is processed in the website thank you again sagittarius i'll see you soon you have a great day bye bye